My name is uh, Emmanuel de Clermont-Tonnerre. I'm born in Paris and uh, I moved to Brazil seven years ago. I'm the owner of Insolito Boutique Hotel, which is located at two hours by car from Rio de Janeiro. I came in Brazil with the idea to do something more creative and uh, after traveling a year in uh, Brazil I didn't find really the hotel of my dream where I thought that Brazil had so much to give and we had that place uh, which was our beach house and uh, it came up very quickly to transform it to as a boutique hotel it was the perfect place for that So here we are in the Brazilian houses, more especially in the Oka room, um, which means house in an Indian dialect. The idea was to link some elements uh, about uh, that town. We have here a picture of Claudia Anduja, which is a famous photographer. Another interesting piece of the room are the chair which is, uh, which is uh, signed by a young, uh, talented Brazil, uh, Brazilian designer, Juliana Lusa, who's really caring about uh, environments and uh, who's working with uh, green labels, which means that uh, the wood she's uh, using is coming from a farm where they replant more than they cut. We are here in the restaurant where we um, ask a production of uh, uh, modernism tiles uh, which come from uh, a community in Rio it's called Azulejaria. Here we are in Rio de Janeiro, in the center of the city, uh, at the atelier of uh, uh, Azulejaria with Laura Tavis. Não é de jogar confete, sua mãe, Dona Elisete, em fevereiro deu a luz. We have started this work about 12 years ago, and uh, it's basically um, an artistic work, and um, also it's divided in many different activities. So, what we do always through the painting of the tiles is to uh, try to promote some social change through arts and through education. We didn't know what, when we started the project how we would carry on the project but then we discovered wonderful people who we actually wanted to continue the process of education, of learning and um, so we created this atelier about uh, eight years ago and uh, it's an income generation project as well because at the end all the, the, the people who were involved in the project um, were professional, professionalized by the, the experience of painting tiles and today we, we do some decorative projects, artistic projects and also educational projects. So those women who actually started as students at the beginning, now they are teachers of um, many groups of children in many other areas in the town. We som de visão é mandingueiro, talentoso e boba pinta. O primeiro ritmista nem tinha chegado aos 30. Brazil is a fascinating country because of its amazing nature and um, the people, their happiness, their joy that they have every day. It's an amazing, rich country, and I think we have so much to learn from them. <laughs> 